Greetings, everyone, and thank you for joining me. Joseph Anderson here in this brief demonstration of the Easy eCover Creator software. First of all, this software makes it so you can um, choose several different layouts and, and stuff for creating e-covers and CDs and uh, membership cards, etc. There's several templates in here, dual covers, here's the CD case and cover, membership cards, even iPods. This isn't all the templates, there's even more, but I'm going to go back to the beginning for this demonstration. And the first thing we're going to do here is this is the item I'm going to choose to create right now. I'm going to choose Apply, and it brings it up into the Designing Palette. I'm going to go down here. I like my items. Normally, I would make them square. So I chose to make the height equal to the width. And DPI will bump it up to 300, which is extremely good quality. The next thing I'm going to do is uh, choose the background, which it's already set. Over here is where you uh, pick the layouts like the background, the top, the front, etc. of how your uh, box or product is going to look here. So the first thing I'm going to do is choose, I'm going to leave the background white. You can choose several different colors if you'd like and um, to make the background, but I'm going to leave mine white in this case. And next I'm going to come down here and choose the next item to bring me to the front of the product and I'm going to choose to close uh, the image and here we have template 16 which comes with the template pack if you so chose to um, get the template pack with easy cover creator the template pack is already also um, sold separately for those who already have the easy cover creator so the first thing I'm going to do in the template pack we've gone ahead and named the items so I'm going to choose front I if I was going to make this into an actual product, I would have already used a graphic editor. I would have already used a graphic editor and gone in here and put the title and any other information on the graphic I want. So next I'll go ahead and choose Open That. And you will see it puts the brings that cover right in here. The next thing I'm going to do is add the side to it. And I'm going to come up here and go Side. And then I'm going to go ahead and last but not least is add the top image to it. And as I had mentioned, folks, all you, you could have already gone to these flat images with a graphic um, editor of some sort and put the text in that you want appearing on them. Now, we have our basic item here. It looks a little dark, so I'm going to go ahead down here in the bottom to the object and slide these over, which will bring, brighten my product right up that I want the cover right up there we go that looks pretty good and uh, I like a little more re reflection in mind so I'm going to go ahead down here and choose to make the reflection up oh, let's say here go over to blur and make it a little stronger of a reflection and now we have our item we can go ahead here and save this picture What's really nice about this is that you can go ahead and let's see what it looks like. I've changed it to template 2 uh, and I click apply and it'll automatically apply our graphics that we have chosen and other settings to this item. So we're going to go ahead and show you what a CD looks like. And here we had not yet put in the CD um, template uh, graphic so I'm going to go over and click once again and load the disk and choose CD and here you've got it notice there's a big ring right here and you can take this and make the CD area a large uh, ring uh, small ring excuse me just by clicking here and as you can see it looks great and I chose to apply that again let's go ahead a few more here apply just to show you around a little bit what there are. Check that out. Let's say we want a membership card of some sort. Just a CD. CD cover with CD. Of course, they could have been two different covers because you're loading separately a, a front and a disc here. So these are many of which you can add in here as you can see 
and then some double stuff. We'll even look at the iPod, or this is MP3 player, excuse me. And that's all there is to it. Thank you for joining me in this demonstration, and have a great day.